Why don't you guys get over here and help us with this puzzle? Yeah. Oh, all right. Maybe you guys will see stuff we don't. Everybody says diversity is our strength, right? Is it, though? Oh, come on. You can't be serious, Seamus. You're against diversity? No, no, I'm not against diversity. But when you use that term, what do you actually mean? Are you looking at superficial traits like skin color or sex? Are you looking for ethnic or cultural diversity? Diversity of professional experience and fields of expertise? Of viewpoints or philosophy? I just want more people to help me figure out where these darn edge pieces go! Who cares what kind of diversity we get? The point is that diverse people will have different ideas. And like you always say, more people working on a problem, exchanging ideas leads to faster innovation. That's true, but it absolutely matters what kind of diversity we're talking about. If Florida Man had a different skin color, would that make him better at solving puzzles for some reason? Is he gonna help more because he's a dude? Uh, I don't think so, no. I know an albina alligator! Will that help? Most of the time, racial or gender diversity doesn't mean anything at all. And what if the new people you bring in are actively working against your goals? That's diversity. Ideological diversity can help us challenge each other's ideas and principles, but even that only works if everyone is at least generally on the same page. If you're trying to promote one worldview and a bunch of people on your team are pushing a totally different set of values, you've got problems. Sometimes cultural diversity is awesome, like when we take a bunch of different music, clothing styles, or food from different parts of the world and put them all together. By the way, you tried my gumbo yet? But some cultures glorify violence, like killing women for wearing the wrong clothes or tossing gay people off buildings. There has to be some baseline of shared values. A free society won't stay free for long if tons of people want communism or fascism instead. Okay, I get it. The details matter. And most of the people who obsessively talk about diversity are only ever talking about the least meaningful kinds. And they never want to include people who challenge their ideas. <laughs> Ah, this table better get a little less diverse. Harumph! What do you think of diversity? Let us know in the comment section below. Please like, share, subscribe, and check out fee.org. Thank you.